Hey everyone! Welcome back. I am back today with more Clone Wars, you guys. I cannot wait to see what is going to happen next on this show. Like, I know ultimately what's going to happen, but they have like really been blowing my mind lately. Um, if you're joining me early today, you already know what it means. It means you are one of my awesome patrons. Thank you so much, and as always, I'm sending up those big old hugs right through that screen. And if not, still thank you for joining me today. I'm glad you're here. I do hope you'll consider supporting me that way. The link to my Patreon is going to be in the description down below. All right, guys. So I think it was last time I said, like, yeah, I'm getting, like, this kind of, I feel like they upped the ante a little bit, and I'm getting, like, this enhanced um, sense of danger, and it's a little bit darker. I don't know. The whole thing with Cad Bane, um, it just feels like there's a lot less off-limits with him. Um... I don't know. Um, I'll get to it more in a second because a lot of last episode had to do with that. Um, but, you know, also we're getting some pretty disturbing stuff, even from like our heroes. Um, last episode, there was this really disturbing like forced force scene um, where like Ahsoka was just looking on like super uncomfortable as um, Anakin, Obi-Wan, and Mace Windu try to, like, forcefully extract information from Cad Bane using the Force. And, I mean, they do talk about it beforehand. They're like, that doesn't seem great, but they're like, well, we don't really have a choice. And, like, they kind of talk about it like it's... I mean, it is a deal, but, I mean, the way that it's, like, not addressed again or anything, like, I think that was even more disturbing that, like, no one brought that up afterwards, you know? It's like, we're just, really, we're just going to kind of go with that. Um, and it really drives home to me this point that they brought up last season um, in the episode with Kit Fisto and his Padawan that, you know, what is the Jedi Order going to look like at the end of this war? Is it going to be the same? Are they going to be able to hang on to their ideals and everything? Or will they have to push past those and do some really questionable things in the name of, like, winning and 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 winning for the good you know and it's like yes they are fighting for the good like we know that but um you know on the other hand you have to be very careful with like um doing things and being able to kind of like justify them without question because of the you know the the greater good or anything like that or the sake of like you know, winning, or that's, you get into some dangerous territory there. When you start, like, justifying stuff based on your cause, that's dangerous. Um, and this is a little bit of a mental stretch, but it even makes me think, like, yes, he's an adult, like, he's not that impressionable, like, he, he has his own Padawan and everything, but you really gotta wonder, does some of that contribute to what Anakin eventually goes through? Because, Clearly, there is a desperate times call for desperate measures kind of tone there. And I mean, if that's kind of what you're used to, I think it's a big leap to say that like that alone. I think that we're going to see a lot of stuff over the, the course of the series that contributes to what eventually happens to Anakin. But um, still, it's like it, it kind of you look at that and it makes sense like, well, he was pretty upset about Padme possibly dying. And he just kind of was able to justify everything he was doing based on that cause. Um, but, I mean, again, that's kind of a leap. But it does kind of present some interesting stuff about the Jedi. Like, come on, guys. They're supposed to be the good guys. What happened to, like, the, you know, yeah, like, attachments are bad. But we'll, like, force, force a guy. <laughs> You know, but no attachments. Hey, come on now. Um, just me being a brat, that's all. But, uh, but yeah, oh, we also had, like, Cad Bane, like, kidnapping children, possible child, like, death in the last episode. They didn't, they weren't trying to kill the children, but they knew it was, like, a possibility that, like, some of them wouldn't survive the process and all this stuff. Um, insult to injury that the poor Jedi that they, like, tortured and killed in the episode prior to that they like went back to kidnap his son i'm like really can you leave his poor family alone please like do they even know that like the the dad the the husband is dead yet um i don't know if they did 
I actually, why did it seem like maybe they didn't know? I feel like maybe, I don't know, I'll have to go back and look. I'll, I'll find out in editing, but, um, or in, you know, comments. But, um, yeah, interesting stuff this season, guys. We're definitely taking the action-adventure vibe with, with a heavy dose of philosophy and adding some darker elements into that mix which was already pretty interesting I gotta say like I love season one but season two so far is like blowing my mind so um the name of this one is called senate spy so that should be interesting so what do you say we go ahead and get started with the next episode let's do it to see you I shall tell mistress Anakin oh can these all, 3PO. get out of here 3PO Four, my lady. yes 3PO now go Scram, 3PO. Oh, yeah. Oh, can these two just have, like, just, like, a few minutes together? It'll be perfect. Five blossom bread. My specialty. You have a specialty? I know how to do lots of things. When I was little, I cooked every day. I've been saving it for a special occasion. Aww. Along with you, I can't think of an occasion more special. <laughs> Yay! Please just be together and be in love for like five minutes. How did Luke and Leia even come to be? They like hardly get time together. If Senator Amadala has already refused to spy on Senator Clovis of the banking delegation, I'm not it. sure how we can change her mind. That is why we ask you to summon young Skywalker. I've been signaling him all night. I don't know where he could be. Mmm, where could he be? <laughs> uh, I have to report Work. to the Jedi Council. Oh, man. Mm, actually, about seven clicks ago. If I keep oh. delaying, Obi-Wan will send a clone squad out to find me. Oh, that one. ducking his signals all night. Oh. I understand. I can sense that you're angry. I don't think you can read my mind. Bad man. You can, though. You shouldn't take this personally. Duty comes first, especially in wartime. She gets that. She Wasn't she just telling him that? It's hard, though. It's very hard. But to be fair, she was, like, just telling him the same thing. He was like, let's go on vacation. She was like, I got work to do. What's going on? Someone he won't suspect. If not a Jedi, who? A fellow senator. Selected Senator Amadala. We have. Why? Why did you call him in for this? That's a good idea. There has to be some worst kept secret. For this. They all know. They were good friends. I didn't know that. Uh. Personal matter. Oh, Obi Wan knows. You know them, why would you? It's just that I wouldn't expect Senator Amidala to have a friend in the banking clan. Master Yoda has already asked her to spy on Clovis for us, and she refused. Trust you, she does, Skywalker. That is why I convince her. You must. Does everyone know about this? They all know about it. Come on. They clearly know there's something more going on here. Did you see Obi Wan's face? Senator Amidala. General Skywalker. Funny thing you hear. Why would I be mad? I'm not mad. Good. Shh. Uh, she's now, mad. About your Anakin. So you need to go to husband 101. Business. I already told Master Yoda. I don't want to spy on a colleague and mm. an old friend. Old friend. An old How friend. Do you know Clovis? Why does that matter? That do tell. We together. Do tell Pammy. How how close how close were you guys? Yeah, kids, man. Old Clovis is going to die. This conspiracy the last place you should be is anywhere near him. Oh. Conspiring with the separatists? Yoda didn't tell me that. Uh. I can't believe Clovis would do that. This is terrible. Oh. I never expected that from him. Now she's gonna. She's like, I'll do it. Has to find out the truth. Oh. does. Not you. Anakin, you did a real good job of convincing her. It never seemed to bother you. I never stopped you from facing danger. You're constantly getting shot at. I've been trained for that. It's very oh. different from spying oh. on a traitor. Oh. Oh, I have I lover's quarrel. Lover's quarrel. Lover's quarrel. Let you do it. You're not going to let me. I'm sorry, it's Anakin. To make. No, it's not, hun. Lucky for us, you've already decided to refuse. Actually, 
I just changed my mind. Mm. It convinced me that it's vital to learn what Clovis is doing. I accept the mission to spy on him. Even though I'm telling you not to. Don't you can't tell. Anakin. Duty comes first. Oh! Especially in wartime. Oh! Oh! I got chills over here. A surprise, that is. I feel like... Given your past. What does that mean, Senator? What? <laughs> Someone clue... Oh no! Oh no! 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 You are killing Anakin. I have to to protect her from her, her old boyfriend. I, I get this. I get this idea that maybe he like half doesn't want her involved with the old boyfriend. Like he is worried about her, but it's also the old boyfriend thing. We can help each other. And fighting me for political reasons or no because you want us to be friends again. Like of course. Friends. I'm far more interested. In It'll be like. Old times. <laughs> On the contrary, I hope it'll be much better than old times. Anakin will end this man. Nobody knows Senator that. Clovis. No, he will kill this man. Oh, he, you're now you're good at that, sweetie. Don't let you, don't let you're angry. He's gonna kill this man. He's gonna kill this man. Oh my God, Anakin. I hope you and I can make a fresh start. I came here with the very same hope. I believe in second chances. So do I. Hey, mate, you're laying it on thick here, my love. You are you're laying this on real thick. A deal is a deal. I'd hate for something to happen to you. You forget my. yourself, Clovis. You cannot threaten me on my own planet. This is hardly your planet anymore. Not since you signed your holdings over to the banking clan in return for a stake in this new droid foundry. Uh oh. Ted <gasps> me be Mother. careful. What are you doing here? She has a type. Um, the angry, messed up type. I was lonely. Perhaps we won't have to. They're now gonna. We finally found his weakness. Nah, Padme! To poison Senator Amida. Oh my god, no, they're gonna go straight to killing her. How does she always no, end up a hostage? She Senator Amidala find something. She's gonna signal me to come inside. Oh, hi. Oh, he's, wa he's waiting by his little space phone. He's waiting by. Oh, honey. No, Pemmy, you be nice now. I know you're mad at him, but still. Are you absolutely sure? Yes, I'm sure. Oh. Three people's like, I'm confused. Aren't you married? Well, we also had a private tour of the palace. Clovis is going to die. Did try to warn her. Oh, a a Anakin, Anakin, you're okay. Baron, rush, Clovis, rush. Padme. Passcode. Dang, he's been carrying that torch. Huh. What's well, it's not conspicuous with your hand behind your back, honey? Tuck, tuck that into your dress or something. <laughs> oh, no! Talk it in your oh god. I don't deserve your kindness. It's nice to hear you say that. God bless it. He's gonna go nuts. He's gonna go nuts. This moment all night. She's like, it's okay. I am. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hotline, what's wrong? Great. 
Oh, dang it. And, and Anakin had to leave, of course, to get that info back. No hologram is available. Oh, no. Oh, great. And there she is, laying there unconscious after he just found out. She's stolen a very valuable disc from me. Return it, and I'll get the antidote from Lot Dot. Oh, no! Negotiating with Lot. She must be saved because I love her. In that case, I suggest you help us back to the Senator's ship before Lot Dot finds anything out. Hmm. Come with me, quickly. So he really does care about her. That must burn Anakin up inside even more. You cannot leave. Uh. Give me the antidote, or you're dead. Oh. There's that method. For this. Give me back my disc. Don't worry, Clovis. Huh. It's good to know you have a heart. I wish huh. I could give you the disc, but I have a lot of faith in your survival skills. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Jedi will use that information to destroy Count Dooku's foundry. Right. The mission was a success. But I know you doubt me. There are things more important than the mission, even in wartime. Uh, uh, go oh, Clovis, Clovis, rip, rip Clovis. Oh no, couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. He really wasn't, I mean, he wasn't like that evil. He clearly was like shady, but, um, Okay, you guys, let's talk. That episode was amazing. Um, the drama, I love Anakin and Padme episodes. And I've said this so many times before, but like I was not like a huge Anakin Padme person from the movies. Um, it was fine. Like we all knew it was it was happening, you know, but like, I mean, at least that's how I felt. Maybe you shipped them hugely. Um, but here, I just like, Every scene with them is like electric. I just love it. And I love the little quarrel. I love Anakin's jealousy. Oh boy, I'll tell you what. I was, I was, I was real worried for Clovis in this. I was like, Clovis, you are a dead man. You have no idea what you've gotten yourself wrapped up into. You have gotten Anakin mad and jealous. Oh, you better run. Um, but in the end, he kind of, like, didn't have to do anything. Uh, Clovis had kind of done it all to himself. Um, but he really did care about her, Clovis. Like, that, like, I thought he would kind of turn on her. Um, but, you know, he, he kind of, like, he was more concerned about her all the way through to the end. Um, which is fortunate. Like, had he been, like, just a little bit more of a loose cannon, who knows what would have happened. Of course, Anakin would have put a stop to that real quick. It's, you don't have to worry about Anakin up against him. Um, so, I just, I loved it. I loved their little... And we saw us a few episodes back with, like, he kind of wanted time with her, and she was like, nah. And this one, she wanted time with him, and it wasn't working, and they had a little spat, and... Um, it's a it's a recurring theme, I'm sure, in their in their relationship that like they friggin' never get to see each other. Like seriously, how how do well they did say that they tried to reach him all night and they couldn't. So I guess that I guess technically that's enough time. <laughs> um. So, but it makes it really makes you wonder like where did they even find time to make twins? Um. So. Uh, yeah, I just, I love the episodes about them. So cute and charm. It's just like, and even here, like, you can see where Anakin's kind of like, he's scared, so he's, like, tightening his grip with their relationship. And you can see, like, the roots of that kind of, like, unhealthy, you know, kind of thing. But it still just comes off really, not that part, but the, oh, on, on the whole, it comes off very cute and charming, like what they have together. Very sweet and very genuine. I mean, it is genuine, whether it's good genuine or bad genuine, like it's genuine love, whether or not it kind of turned bad, sour, whatever in the end, um, unhealthy but yeah, definitely you can see the start of like Anakin being really afraid to lose her and so like not maybe kind of jumping past her wants, needs 
feelings just to straight like I just need to protect you like don't argue with me on this like I've I have spoken <laughs> it's like no Anakin you cannot do that you need to and then the thing with the bread too when he was like really you cook I'm like oh Anakin honey no you need to go to like husband 101 I know you've been busy with the Jedi and all but no 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 you you need some husband training sweetheart um I loved it I absolutely loved it that was oh man I just loved their episode so much so much. So you guys, I had a blast with that. So much fun. I hope you had a blast watching along with me. Um, loving the season so far. Cannot wait to see more. Thank you so much for joining me today. Please be sure to join me next time and we will watch it together. Bye for now, guys.